Now, this is something I should have looked up earlier. It turns out there is a website that can generate height map data for real world locations. And I've just tried to line it up with the um, map I was creating yesterday. Or was it two days ago? Whenever I was creating it. Um, so hopefully we can get some height data into the map. Um, anyway, this is Swindon area. I've tried as best I can to align the features. I'm using the roads and rails as a reference point. So we see the split in the rail pretty much bang in the centre there. So that is ideal because that's where it is also in... Uh, the map I was creating and I tried to get the scaling so and this is about right it might be slightly out but even if it is I think it'll be close enough um, this should hopefully make things a lot closer to reality and a bit more interesting so next step is to attempt to import the data from here into the map editor okay I just imported the height map and yeah there's some major problems here so it looks like, for starters, I got the order wrong. I should have put the height map in before I laid any roads because now all the roads are <coughs> fixed. And I'm wondering, is there enough height variation to make it interesting? I mean, it's quite lumpy, quite noisy, I guess, because of the data. But is there enough height to make this worth using anyway? So if I just reorientate myself again, uh, <clears throat> I mentioned already that around here is what's known as Old Town. And if you drive along this road towards Old Town, there's quite a steep hill about here. So do we see that steep hill? And there is, yeah, a slight lump there, I suppose, but it's not really significant. I mean, with smoothing, can I? Is there a smooth button? I can't remember how it uses. Not level, but smooth. Soften. Uh, needs to be much bigger than that. I mean, does that look like enough of a hill? Actually, that doesn't look so bad, I suppose. Of course, the problem I still have is. I really don't want to relay out all the roads again. And how do I fix this? Can I fix this? There is a reset sea level tool. So I could use that to if I use that before the height map before I import the height map, maybe I can get the roads closer to where it is and it won't be cut into such steep valleys anymore. I wonder if that's a possibility. The other question I have is somewhere over here. I don't know where it is now. Somewhere over here I did try to put um, the lake at Lydia Park and I don't see anything resembling a lake. There might be a slight depression there maybe but no that's the normal location anyway that's too far over. It would be somewhere over here. So oh that helps a lot doesn't it? Takes out a lot of the noise. I'm still not sure exactly where the lake should be now because it's not very visible but yeah lots of smoothing then maybe put the road on top but do I really want to restart all this process again I don't know and like I said at least it does look like there is some hilly area there Um, what if I try I'll just use the first one for now just to see how, what it looks like if I just import it straight in so 
to import height map. So how does that look? I mean it's still quite lumpy, but maybe not as bad as the last one. I don't know, was the one I chose last time just a more aggressive looking colouring? <coughs> I'm going to try smoothing again anyway. Oh, where is it? No, no, yeah. Let's move. So once again, big brush. I'll literally just wave it over. I'm totally disoriented. I don't know which way is up anymore. Yeah, that's not a good, good start, is it? So just take out some of the harshness without hopefully eroding too many features. So, <coughs> very roughly... Could that be the old town area I was looking at the other day? Ooh. <coughs> I mean, a bit of con yeah. So, I think that's the right way around. So, that's probably old town area. And that's the. I don't know what it's called, Ridgeway, is it? Or is that further over? So do I want to redo all the roads just to get that little plateau there? Or do I just manually try to paint in a plateau later? I'm quite I'm more tempted of a second option actually. Because like I said, Swindon is pretty flat overall, you don't really notice much of a hill anywhere. Uh, apart from that one. So maybe I can just try to patch that in manually afterwards. Well, I'm not going to make any decisions right now. I'll have a think about it and see what other options I have. I mean, it'd be brilliant if they could use the map data and put the roads in place for me as well, but that might be asking a bit too much. Um, okay, I'll leave it there for now. Something to think about and see where we go.